There's lots of ways to make money, but even less ways to build generational wealth. I'm A. Donahue Baker, and I've partnered with many people over the years to buy, build, and develop real estate. But the one thing that I've noticed that successful real estate millionaires do is continue their evolution. I say evolution because when most people get a little success in real estate, they get comfortable. But that is the exact time when you have to keep pushing and acquire more and more and bigger and bigger deals to complete your real estate evolution. Because acquiring optimal deals take consistent effort for searching for opportunities. Because there's no such thing as a real estate supermarket that you can just find down aisle seven, a 35% below market value, value add opportunity. It just doesn't work that way. When you achieve some measure of success, you have to convince yourself mentally to say, okay, I'm on the right path. Now let's keep pushing. Your thought process should be, how could you repeat or how could you scale that process to get more and more real estate? The real estate life cycle for many starts like this. People rent for a short period of time, then they save up some money to purchase a home that they can live in. Some time passes by and the pride of home ownership diminishes. And just when it diminishes, they realize that the home that they just purchased is actually a liability. And that's where most people either turn to mentors or turn to education to find out how they really should have been purchasing real estate. I even know a lot of people that are killing it at wholesaling, but the income that they're making from wholesaling or flipping, it's a trap. It's keeping them from really evolving to the next level of real estate ownership. Without being a true owner, it's difficult to build wealth. So my advice to you is if you truly want to build wealth, you must complete your evolution. Completing your evolution means at some point you must say no to every other deal that is not your focus, your criteria. And to me, if you have real estate, you should be looking to evolve into commercial real estate. And for clarity's sake, commercial real estate is defined as residential units that are five units or more. That includes hotels, bars, warehouses, strip malls, shopping malls, office buildings, even bridges anything that can be used for a commercial purpose. Completing your evolution means that you've graduated to the next phase. And real estate takes a certain amount of focus that you must consistently show over a period of time. If you're looking for single families and duplexes in a certain town, you'll never catch that 20 unit off market deal. There's merit to starting small, but if you truly want to be a real estate millionaire, you have to be able to scale. And there's no better way to scale than getting involved in commercial real estate and truly completing your evolution. I'm A. Donahue Baker, and I hope you got some real valuable information from this video. Remember, time is your most valuable asset. Don't waste it. What you do every single day determines your legacy. That's all I got. See you on the next clip. Peace.